patients like the dynamic resistance of the variable rate four foot spring, which has been designed to provide optimal function suitable for a broad range of activities and loading. Elements of the 1C40 Seawalk foot include the C-spring and four-foot spring, both made of carbon fiber composite material, a control ring with polymer insert, plastic heel fulcrum, modular adapter with adjustment pyramid, clamp pieces and bolt assembly, dorsiflexion wedge, and a foot shell that's both functional and cosmetic. This prosthetic foot is specially designed for optimal energy storage and return, which flows smoothly from one element to another. The yellow path shows the energy flow within the C-spring and dorsiflexion spring. During loading response, the C-spring is automatically compressed. Following foot flat, this stored energy is released during mid-stance. During initial forefoot loading, the C-spring will automatically open. This deflection of the C-spring is limited by the control ring, as highlighted in green. As the C-spring approaches its limit, the dorsiflexion spring is gradually flexed, resulting in a smooth, controlled rollover resistance. During pre-swing, both the C-spring and dorsiflexion spring return virtually all of their stored energy to the patient as they revert to their unloaded position. The result is a very smooth rollover with optimal energy storage and return. This innovative design was based on scientifically measured values such as ankle moments and energy return curves derived from human gait analysis studies. This concept by French prosthetist Pierre Chablot has resulted in an energy efficient, comfortable prosthetic foot which has been clinically tested in the inventor's home country. The extensive plantar flexion movement of this foot is most easily noted during loading response immediately following heel strike. This cutaway of the shell shows the individual elements of the foot. The multi-axial motion of the Seawalk foot is particularly useful on gradients and inclines. The unique control ring ensures a smooth transition from one spring element to the other throughout stance phase. The laser posture measurement tool may be used to verify and document optimal alignment. In the frontal plane, the limb load line should contact the lateral border of the patella.